Hey, I'm John Gordon at the National Weather Service in Louisville. I've been doing this for 35 years. I want to help you get out of your parents' basement and stop playing video games all the time. So here's the deal. If you want to get a job, look at this map behind me from schools from Plymouth State to Penn State to Purdue, from Oswego all the way to Oklahoma, Arizona to Alaska. They're going to school at St. Louis University to St. Cloud. People take synoptic, they take mesoscale, they take dynamics. Is that enough just to get a job in meteorology, the greatest job in the whole world? I want you to work harder and think differently than everyone else. Take the classes that no one else has taken. Get out of your parents' basement. I'm going to tell you how to do that. People skills are the most essential part of the job. I hire for people with the best people skills. If you are going to school with someone who you cannot stand, who's a jerk, we don't want them here at the Weather Service or any other employer. Next, I look at customer service. The place you want to be treated the best, the places that you go to, you enjoy. I like going to the Marriott. My pleasure. Good to see you, Mr. Gordon. You need an umbrella today? I like innovative people. People who think beyond today, who think about tomorrow. Then I do a strengths, a weaknesses, opportunity thread on you. I think about what are the best qualities to hire this person into the team. Last but not least is the right fit. Are they going to fit well into this atmosphere, 24 hours a day, 365? If you have these skills, I look forward to seeing you the next time there's an opening. Be innovative. Don't do what everyone else is doing. Go differently. Seek a different direction. Be like Tom Skilling did in broadcasting and Ginger Z and Janice Huff and Jim Cantori. I want you to think like Rich Grum, who came up with the spaghetti plots and ensembles. Think about Mike Gibson and the radar softwares and radar scope. I want you to think completely, absolutely different than everyone else. Tom Nizzle in Lake Effect Snow Forecasting. Or like Dr. Fujita, Mr. Tornado. Look what he did in all of convection. This kind of stuff will help you get a job. It might just light up your future. How are your technical skills? Are they in the top 10% of everyone you know? Do you know Python? Python is in. Fortran is out. How many GIS classes have you taken? Are you taking more than your friends around the room? There's 30 of you for one job. What are you doing with graphics? Do you make the best graphics around or are you just average? Do you do things like Canva and make these amazing graphics for your next job? How about language? Do you know Spanish? Do you know ASL? Do you know ways to communicate to the underserved? Have you done to a paper, a presentation, a research project? Do more than everyone else. Here are my top five suggestions to help you get a job in the greatest weather enterprise in the world. Number one, have the best people skills. Not the worst, the best. Think about someone you know you really like how they are, be that person. Two, improve your computer skills. Have more things up your sleeve than your neighbor, especially in GIS. I can't emphasize how to innovate and be different than everyone else. Don't be like everyone else. Take different classes, different skill sets, seek different opportunities. Go and network, don't be afraid. Whether it's a QR code, a business card, a LinkedIn, network. Find out what companies need. Become the expert. With the next big thing that's coming online, be that expert and play offense, not defense. These five things will help you get a job.